Hey guys, my name is Ben, and welcome back to episode 55 of your Bucket Plugin Tutorials. Today we're going to be looking at written books and writing inside of books and stuff, but in the Bucket API. Now, this is a very simple, simple thing to do, uh, so it's not going to be a very long episode. And the way we do it is if we just make it on command quickly, so hit control space, and then it'll open this thing, just remove everything here, and at the bottom we're just going to return, return false, because we just want to get rid of the errors. Now again, I'm doing this quickly, you can obviously tidy this up and do more checks and stuff, so we're just going to check if the sender is a player, so if the sender is an instance of player, um, import everything, and if they're not an instance of the player, we're just going to say sender dot send message, like, uh, you have to be a player to use this command, there we go, like that, and so if they are a player, what we want to do is we want to make an item stack. So we're going to say item stack uh, book equals a new item stack, uh, which is going to be a material dot written book. So that's a book that's already been written, uh, like that. So if we just import that from org bucket. Now what we want to do is we want to get some book uh, metadata. So we say book uh, meta or meta, and we say bm equals book dot get item metadata like that and then we have to cast it to book metadata so slash or book meta so that's basically converting the item metadata into book metadata and now what we're going to do is this is where we can type in all of our stuff so we could say bm dot uh, I don't know like add page so we could add a page with all of our stuff in so in in the first page we're going to say hello this is my book go away I like books like that and then we can have more pages by saying comma and then another string so we could say this is still my book I don't like people looking at my book and then again we could have more and more pages um, you could say bm .add enchantment, but that's for like you know enchantments with the books and that enchanted books um, now, normally, when you make a book, it says like your book title and then by the player. Uh, obviously, with this, it wouldn't work. It would just call it a written book and it wouldn't have anything else. So the way we fix this is we say bm dot set uh, author, and we could say by uh, the awesome server like that, and then we could say bm dot set title as being like the awesome book uh, and obviously there's more stuff here like you could set the law still and you could set pages like you could set page one and then obviously here's some more um, stuff here this there's obviously it's quite self-explanatory like set page you could set the page at the number as to be that stuff you could set the pages in a list of strings um, and actually it's another one uh, if we remove all this this is actually a better way of doing it you could say bm dot set pages and the way we do this list of strings normally is we make a list of strings and stuff and this is another way of doing it we just type arrays dot as list and then we'll come up with this t thing and basically you have your stuff in here so this is my book and then we put a comma and then we say something else and we say this isn't isn't my book like that so basically what this is saying is we're making a list of of strings and we're say is no Liz list uh, never mind. Uh, this is just a quick thing. And every time we have something else in here, it's saying list dot add this. So it's being added to a list and at the end it converts it all back into a list of strings. So that's how that works basically. Obviously you can add chat colours and stuff into this. We haven't actually added a, a label yet, so if label dot equals ignore case like test mainly test because you know I've already had to test it up we don't need the curly bracket at the end of here because this if statement like covers all of it so it just doesn't I just it saves space um so yeah if we actually export this I'm gonna actually show how this works and stuff so I'll see you in the game okay one one big thing I forgot actually is is a very big thing we have to say um book dot set I, t I just opened Minecraft, so it's gonna be like set item metadata to be BM, and then of oh yeah you heard that uh, we're gonna say brackets brackets player sender 
uh, dot get inventory dot add item book so we're gonna add the book to inventory that's basically just updating the the metadata for the for the whole oh god this noise is it's updating the metadata for the book um, and adding it with the new metadata we just set so yeah let's export this uh, no reload this monitor's colors is so much better than my other monitor's colors it's outrageous the colors is just crazy so anyway, reload complete so now if we do slash test we get book see it's called the awesome book by the awesome server and if we open the awesome book it's going to say page one of two this is my book page two this isn't my book so obviously we can add chat colors and if you add chat colors into that it will make things colorful and awesome so that's how you do books another tutorial done ba -dum, ba -dum, ba -dum. if you have any problems comment send me messages check on bucket forums my name is that color because I'm using the Batnight plugin on this server don't worry that's a good why am I using this what's wrong hmm. anyway uh, thank you for watching people um, I will see you next time remember to go check out the bat night the bat .com. remember to post on bucket forums if you don't understand comment if you don't understand like favorite and subscribe I will see you next time